Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for December 5th of 2023. Well, it is titled energetic particle strikes the Earth. So what do we see here? Well, this shows a cosmic ray particle coming from the upper left side and striking Earth's atmosphere. Now, when a cosmic ray does this, it will cause a great shower of particles, as you can see, coming down to Earth. Now, we can't detect the cosmic ray itself directly. It's gone up in the Earth's upper atmosphere. However, the shower of particles will reach Earth and some of those can be detected. Now cosmic rays occur all the time. So what makes this one so interesting? Well, it's first of all recently discovered and is an, and is an extremely high energy cosmic ray. We should discuss what is a cosmic ray in the first place. And cosmic rays are not like things like x rays. X rays are light. They are just a form of light with a much shorter wavelength and a much higher energy. Cosmic rays are actually particles, generally the nuclei of atoms, and the vast majority of them would be things like protons. So a proton traveling at a very high speed uh, from some source out in the uh, cosmos could then st eventually strike Earth. Now, when that occurs, this is the thing about this one is that is extremely high energy. So one of the most higher energy ones and was actually recorded a couple of years ago and just recently confirmed. Now, with something like this, there are a couple of questions. How can a single nucleus acquire so much energy? So that is a very good question as to how you can get the particle moving so fast and where did it actually come from and that's another good question one of the problems with trying to trace cosmic rays is that they are charged particles so unlike light or x-rays or radio waves which do not have any electrical charge and will travel pretty much straight through the universe so you can trace them back very easily Cosmic ray particles, on the other hand, have electrical charges and electrical charges are affected by magnetic fields. So even traveling through space, their direction could be changed. So looking at where they appear to come from may not tell us exactly where they do come from in space. And any efforts to trace this one back has not given us any potential source in any area that we consider likely. So they probably come from very energetic events uh, that occurred somewhere around. So could that be something like the center of an active galaxy where a black hole has material swirling into it? Or maybe something like an extremely strong supernova or gamma ray burst could cause something like this. But it is still something that the whole details of are not really known. So that was our picture of the day for December 5th of 2023. It was titled Energetic Particle Strikes the Earth. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, preview to be torched by stars. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.